All right, this is game two between Zateo and Sun Raider. Zateo spawned at the top left and Sun Raider at the top right. Uh, so yeah, the exact same spawns from the first game. And it looks like both players doing the same exact thing as the first game. Sun Raider setting his SCV down to the bottom right corner. Zateo having a very even spread towards Sun Raider's side. And uh, yeah, he's a little bit further down than, than uh, Sun Raider is, so he's able to kind of force Sun Raider back a bit. Um, if Sun Raider chose to kind of do the same thing, but he's behind, he's probably not going to take a great engagement. Um, but yeah, here is the engagement, and Sun Raider um, trades a little bit, but then decides to back out. And yeah, it looks like he might lose a bunch here, but Zateo, he's pushed pretty far forward here. I don't think he really has enough units to, to actually do, do with that. Um, actually, different from his last game, he decides to go with five movement speed, two armor. Again, no uh, weapon damage, though. Sun Raider, meanwhile, has 23114. So he's a little bit behind on movement speed, but he does have the attack to make up for it. A uh, little bit of engagement there, but Sun Raider uh, backs out and engages here. But a lot of his forces are a little spread out, while, while Zateo's is very much like together and all fighting at the same time. So Zateo takes that pretty handily. Backing out now, um, trying not to get too greedy with his position. Trying to just take mid instead of, uh, you know, force Sun Raider back and get greedy with kills. Uh, Sun Raider, again, he's he's pushing forward with um, quite a few units here to kind of maybe just like peek and see what's going on. Uh, maybe, you know, catch some units that are coming out. Uh, but yeah, Zateo caught that pretty quickly. Now Sun Raider, he might lose a bunch of units here. I wonder if he's going to nuke to counteract, counteract that. Uh, the nuke does not go off, instead he loses a bunch of units here, and now it looks really good for Zateo. Nuke does go off here, but again, it's on Sun Raider's side, so this is really, really, uh, you know, it's more useful for Zateo, actually. He had, you know, he had some units left over, whereas Sun Raider did not. Um, Sun Raider going forward here, he throws a turret. Zateo looks like he's a, he was about, you know, looking to build. But yeah, with this turret here, he's going to have to respond to that instead. He pushes forward here, throws his own turret. I don't know if I really like that placement. It's a little bit too far down. But yeah, it's definitely going to help out kill this turret. Um, and yeah, there's a tail there just kind of pushing forward. Sun Raider, you know, he backed out to, to try not to take too much damage from his marines, but that allowed the tail to, to kill the turret pretty he pretty easily. And uh, yeah, now it's it's like Zateo's, you know, he's, he's ahead on score by quite a bit. He still has a nuke. He's throwing down a bunker. And uh, Sun Raider, you know, he's picked off a few units right there, but uh, he's got to be really careful. He is on his side, but Zateo has so many more units. He, he, Zateo picks off the SCV, and Sun Raider's forced back. Yeah, at this point, this is pretty rough. It's going to be really hard for Sun Raider to be able to do much with this. Zateo sees the mineral from the watchtower, and Sun Raider calls GG.